welcome back to the channel. Today, we're diving into two of the top real-time renderers used by architects, Twinmotion and D5 Render. Both have serious strengths, but depending on your workflow, one might fit you better than the other. And if you want to go deeper into D5's newest features, we just dropped a full video all about it. It's up on our channel now, so check that out after this. If you're ready, let's get started. Let's start with Twin Motion. It's known for its realistic lighting, powered by Lumen and Path Racer, giving you lifelike illumination and shadow details that make every scene feel cinematic. It also shines when it comes to animated assets, things like swaying trees, changing seasons, or natural light transitions, perfect for walkthroughs and client presentations. Twin Motion also connects with Quicksell Megascan, Sketchfab, and Adobe Substance, so you've got access to tons of high-quality materials and models right away. Since it's built on Unreal Engine, it feels familiar and intuitive. And because Epic Games made it free for many users, it's a great option if you're just getting into rendering or want high-end visuals without big upfront costs. All right, quick pause for architects and firm owners out there. If your deadlines are piling up and you need support with construction docs, we get it. At MGS Global Group, we're architects helping out other architects. We've been doing this for over 18 years and our team plugs right into your workflow with on-demand project architects experienced in BIM. And we can start in as little as 24 hours. Learn more at mgsglobalgroup.com if you're interested. All right, back to the video. Now, on to D5 Render. D5 Render focuses on speed, efficiency, and photorealism. It's super easy to learn and lets you set up detailed scenes fast. A big win for anyone with tight deadlines. D5's real-time ray tracing delivers impressive reflections, shadows, and small texture details, like how concrete actually feels or how grass catches light. Its native asset library is constantly growing and built for architects, so you spend less time searching for materials and more time designing. D5's AI tools like atmosphere matching and style transfer automatically adjust lighting and tone, helping you get realistic results faster. It's subscription-based, but many pros find it worth it for how consistent and fast it performs. Just depends on your budget. Cool. So which one should you pick? Go for Twin Motion if you want cinematic, hyper-real lighting and love adding movement to your visuals. It's great for presentations, client walkthroughs, or even educational projects. Pick D5 Render if you care more about speed and streamlined workflows. It's perfect for architects or studios that need quick turnarounds and frequent updates without sacrificing quality. At the end of the day, both tools deliver stunning results. It really just depends on your workflow, hardware, and budget. If you can, try both. Twin Motion offers a free version to experiment with, while D5 has a free trial and pro plan for more advanced use. D5 runs smoothly even on mid-range GPUs, while Twin Motion scales its performance depending on your setup. So check your hardware before you dive in. So thanks for watching. Which one's your favorite? Twin Motion or D5 Render? Drop it in the comments, hit like if this helped you out, and subscribe for more videos like this. Hopefully, see you on the next one.